Ryan Parsons, we start with local baseball. The hottest team in the International League, the Tide, home at Harbor Park, taking on the Toronto Blue Jays' top affiliate, the Buffalo Bisons. It was Virginia Tech Hokies night at the ballpark, and that's former Tech running back Kevin Jones throwing out the first pitch. He seemed a little nervous. He needed the glove as a security blanket, but he got it over the plate. Nice throw there by Jones. Orioles pitcher Roboto Jimenez making a rehab start for Norfolk, but we're going to pick it up here in the bottom of the third, scoreless. And here's Francisco Peguero of the Tides, the chopper to pitcher Sean Nolan. Routine play, right? Not quite. Nolan going to sail it past Bison's first baseman Brett Wallace, and Peguero going to make it all the way to second base on the throwing error by Sean Nolan. Now, still in the third, Quinton Berry going to send Peguero home on the single up the middle that falls in shallow center. Tides take the one to nothing lead. As for Jimenez, Solid on the hill for the Tides. He went six strong innings, surrendering five hits and one run on 94 pitches. But Norfolk could not hold on to that one run lead, though. Buffalo going to walk away with a two to one win. But in the grand scheme of things, this Tides team that went 20 and eight in July has really turned things around and, believe it or not, are not completely out of the playoff race. Oh, it's a lot of fun, especially where we came from. You know, we struggled a little bit the first few months of the season, and then it's been a really nice uh, turnaround. It's done the way you should do it. We've had uh, promotions from below, guys that have earned the call-up in uh, Alvarez, Walker, Wilson. Um, we've acquired people, Jimmy Paredes, who's got a really nice track history and is a, is a really interesting player. And then the guys that we have here, it seems like when you get that stuff, it seems like all of a sudden they have elevated their game as well. Tides of Buffalo again tomorrow night at Harbor Park. And by the way, some Tides trivia. According to Media Relations Director Ian Locke, Hubato Jimenez is the first player in Tides history whose first name starts with a U. Now to Major League.